We're excited that we are here. We're excited to be amongst family and friends in this intimate gathering to hear stories. We are near the end, and as a community, we can stand together and help raise awareness, reduce stigma. We can eradicate it. We're going to continue to capture the depth and diversity of the stories that make up HIV and AIDS in our communities, the voices across this region to tell stories in an oral history exactly as our ancestors have been doing to tell history for centuries. So thank you again, all of you, for being part of that mission. It's been 30 years since Mr. Johnson made his announcement. Here I am, my family's excited that I'm doing the work, I'm talking to him about it, but my cousin still was infected with the virus. And still my family had the stigma. Once they came to the testing events on Slauson and Western or Crenshaw and Manchester, it still hit home. And they, they gave me questions that I was shocked. You know, do I put a towel on the, sh on the couch? I'm like, no. I think about my son who's 24 and I think about my oldest two kids who are parents now. I want them to live in a community to where they don't have to worry about HIV. That for me is why I still continue to do the work, why I'm excited to be here today. Doesn't matter the name of the organization, we gotta walk elbow to elbow through the rough times and knowing that there's a power greater than us that's carrying us through the rough times. We gotta be right there because I need you. You need me, we need each other to do the work of eradicating AIDS in our community. Uh, it's important to have these uh, stories and these monuments because to let people know that you're not alone. It is scary, it can be very disheartening, but there are medications and support for you to have so that you can continue to live your life as freely and happily as you should be able to, free of judgment. We're only as sick as our secrets, and through us giving our testimony and sharing our stories, we find solidarity, we find strength, and we find power. And through that, we're gonna be able to end the HIV and AIDS epidemic.